What's going on, guys? This is Forever Burning TV, guys. I am feeling the Dream's new EP, Crown. Guys, he also has an album called Jewel Crown or Crown Jewel or something like that coming out in later June or July. Guys, I, I got to get the date. But the Dream, as you all know, is one of my favorite producers slash artist slash singer slash rapper. Guys, he's very, very, very talented. Guys, I think I did a review... I, do, I don't know if I did a review on his last album, Foreplay. I don't. I don't think I. I don't. I don't recall. Maybe, but guys, I'm just gonna do this review on his EP, guys. Crown. Let's let's get to these songs first and foremost. Ha ha. EP itself has six songs, guys, and I actually love the songs. Okay, guys. Now, if you guys know the Dream Style, is nothing new. Okay, guys. He always does a lot of mixtures of hip hop with with with, with rap and R and B. And guys, I love these songs. The first song which we have is Prime, guys. I actually love Prime, guys. It has a very nice R and B sound to it. Uh, it's smooth, kind of. Uh, Dream always makes smooth songs, guys. I always like his stuff. Um. Prime was just giving me a, just a a, 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 a a nice feel of R&B, guys. I really like it. Uh, it's a song I will play over and over and over, and I like it. The beat sounds real nice, and it's very it's, it's catchy, and it's just one of my favorites. Okay, now that's number two. Okay, featuring T.I., guys. That was definitely a club joint. You know, t the Dream is always good for making club joints, guys. This is what I like about the Dream. He has a lot of songs that you can dance to, guys, and uh, that's my shit. Well, you know, it, it, it sounds like a title that he made before. It sounds like a song he kind of made before, which most of his songs do. But, guys, he always comes up with different ideas in between you know, his projects, uh, his last album, which I love, which was Foreplay, guys, I, 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 I loved it, okay. This is number three, All I Need was giving me Fancy from his second album, Love Vs. Money, guys, which is, that is one of my favorite albums by The Dream, but Love Vs. Money, don't even get me started, like, cut after cut after cut, but anyway, all I Need was kind of giving me Fancy a little bit. Fancy was one of my favorite songs on Love Vs. Money. And guys, that song was just, get, you know, it had a nice little beat to it. Uh, you know, he's always good at making, you know, uh, heartbreak type songs when you getting over, when you in your relationships and you just not getting over your girl and you want to say fuck her uh, or you want to say love her. You know, he just always got songs that, that make you reflect on love and hate and you know, Love and Hate, which is his first album, guys. I love I love just about all the Dream stuff, guys. Don't even get me started. He is a genius. And all I need was just one of my favorites because it just had it just got into a a, a, a heartbreak feel. You know, like this bitch really hurt me and blah 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 blah. I just I I I I I I I I I can't let you go. Even though you hurt me, I still can't let you go. Y'all all that I need. Y'all I just love it. I love it. I love it. Then we had number four, which is Fruition. Guys, Fruition gave me a little Michael Jackson, okay? And I was there, I was loving the sound. It just had a nice little pop, doom, doom, kind of a little Charlie Wilson, a little uh, Isley Brothers, little Isley Brothers, Charlie Wilson, Charlie Wilson type sound to it. A little Michael Jackson is, guys, it was giving me a little er, a late 80s flavor on it, and I love it, guys. It, it couldn't pass for R. Kelly song, too. But, guys, I, I liked it. Fruition is, is good. Then we got Throw It Back, which is one of them pop it, pop, lock, and drop it, throw your ass in the egg type 
songs <laughs> that just make you want to twerk in the club. You know, them little twerk popping, booty popping type songs <laughs> for, for, for ladies to go to in the club. Y'all was definitely feeling throw it back. You know, uh, it's just, it's, 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 it's a turn up song, guys. I love it. Then we got Sadie's Benz, which had, which, had, which is number six. Sadie's Benz had three parts. It had the, the, the go hard part. It had the I'm on I, 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 I'm a thug part, and then it had the fucking romance end theme, and then it went back to the to, to the thug part. And y'all, I love it. It's got three parts to this song, guys. All in one song, guys. It's cold. I like it. It's it's fresh. It's different. And guys, um, please look at I think his his new album, which will be coming out, I think July or June. Uh, uh guys, I gotta get the date. But it's called Crown Jewel or Jewel Crown, y'all. I gotta get it together. But guys, it's gonna he has two EPs. It's pretty much this is half of his half of the album right here. But this is just the EP. So guys, regardless, this is just the first half of the album that I'm doing. You know, the album comes out, I believe, in June, guys. I gotta get this date. I gotta get this date together. But regardless, it's good. For all the Dream fans, check it out. You're going to like it. Uh, I like it, you know, I'm a, I'm, y'all, as y'all know, I'm a, I'm a huge Dream fan, I like most of y'all his stuff, so guys, check it out, I'm gonna send the link in the description, this is Forever Brandon TV, you know what, turn up, turn up, get your life, this is gonna be a good day, okay, I have rehearsals today, and I don't wanna be late for that, so guys, this is Forever Brandon TV, signing off.